Tuesday, you watch a Tasty Tuesday show with Tuesday, try me some of the tasty. Sometimes it works. I just got off a plane, like literally just got off a plane and drove to my house and then it was between doing this or taking a shower and I chose you. You're welcome. If you'd like to see a version of me that bathes and wears undergarments though, you should check out the sketch I put on my channel last week. It's super funny, it's super relatable, I'm very proud of it. I would like to do more content like this, so any love and support you could give it, I would much appreciate it. If you want to go over there now, I don't have a problem with it. And now back to this video. I got off a plane from Utah. It was very cold there. I thought, hey, you know what would be nice? A cup of chili. You know it'd be extra nice if I could hold it in my hand. So I thought we would combine two recipes that we've already done on Tasty Tuesday. The beer chili recipe from Minimalist Baker and this cornbread recipe from Food Genius. We're putting it together to make a cornbread beer chili cupcake or muffins, which is just an acceptable form of cupcakes that you can eat at mealtime. We're also about to see another Patriot Super Bowl, so I thought maybe we can switch up the food at least this time. Let's make this dish! Now since I have made the main parts of this recipe already on two separate Tasty Tuesday videos, which you can watch here and here, I'll leave links in the description if you want to check those out. Both the cupcakes and the chili take about an hour, so hopefully they'll be ready at about the same time. Speed this shit up! Large pot, medium high heat. Oh my gosh. One tablespoon olive oil. Then we're gonna... One large white onion, chopped. Like the show, but far less drama. Sometimes. And then we half a green pepper diced. I didn't say what kind of pepper. I'm guessing bell pepper. We don't know. And we don't care. Let's just get through this. Speed it up. Four garlic cloves. Half teaspoon each of salt and pep. Do it. All of it. Hurry it. Speed it. And then we'll cook. Stirring off in six to eight minutes. While that's happening, preheat oven 425. Do it. Tiny pot. No offense. Six tablespoons of water. Boil it. Are you stirring? Two tablespoons of ground flax seed. It's the flax zone. I don't know. Skip ahead. Oh my gosh. Three minutes. Tablespoon of chili powder to the onions and peppers. Cook for another minute. Chili powder makes it louder. I'm trying to come up with a good catchphrase for this chili. It's not gonna work right now. Keep moving. An entire beer. Modela Negra. Party. And then we cook until reduced by half, about six to eight minutes. Do it. Oh, this is done. Medium bowl. And then we one cup of all purpose flour. By the way, not pregnant, just wearing a baggy shirt. Everybody cool? Great. One cup cornmeal. And then we fourth cup of sugar. And then we four teaspoons of baking powder. It gets louder for baking powder. Still not working for this. Three fourths teaspoon salt. And then whisk. And then stir. And then add that flaxseed mixture to this bowl. Oh, thank you. Hi. Oh, hi. To the beer chili, we're going to add a 28 ounce can of diced tomatoes in the juice. Cool. And then can of red kidney beans slightly drained, black beans slightly drained. If you want to add meat, you can do that. Fourth teaspoon each of salt and pepper. Oh, you know it. Get in there. Bring this pot to a simmer and then slightly crush the tomatoes with a spoon. About 25 to 30 minutes. Now back to this. Fourth cup of canola oil. And then mix. Cup of milk. Milk. Disperse this into this. 15 minutes. What are we missing? Add some setups to terrible jokes. What do you call a bean? Say the punchlines to some jokes. The can can. <laughs> bean there, done that. <laughs> yes, we can. Yes, we can. Please don't drop on me. I don't even think you can consider that to be comedy. I would add some more puns, but they'd be really corny and I don't think you're bready. <laughs> because cornbread. Again, watch my sketch. Ooh. Okay, we heard you. I did this. We've already done this before though. So we're gonna let these cool. 10 minutes? Yeah. Not pregnant. Mmm. Looking thick and smelling good. Oh, the chili's okay too. <laughs> I'm gonna take it off the heat. This is the part of the recipe that hasn't been done before. So we're gonna take our cupcakes, muffins. We're gonna take our little scooper and we're gonna scoop out the middle of all of these. Then we're gonna save the middle for future consumption. Probably with the same chili. How about that? We don't waste. Now all of our muffins have some holes in them. We're gonna fill those with the chili. You guessed it. Netflix and chili fill those holes, you know what I'm saying? Slap it high. No joke, this chili smells so good. Okay, great, look at that. Hopefully this works and you can actually pick it up with your hands and it doesn't all fall apart in your face, you know? Now the only thing I think I'd do is top it with some cheese. I would do cheddar cheese, but I think I only have mozzarella. Oh no, I have some cheddar, cool. A little bit of cheddar, a shred of cheddar. I'm gonna put some cheddar and then whatever I don't have left of this, I'm gonna put some mozzarella, which I know is the wrong kind of cheese for chili. But we're not cheese shaming in this kitchen, okay? So you can just go home, cheese bully. Then we're just gonna pop these back in the oven for like two minutes until the cheese melts. 
And we should be golden. Pony boy. It's here! Ooh, look at this. Look at this perfect mess of delicious mess of deliciousness. Huh. Huh. Well, I know separately these two things are tasty. Together, it has never been done. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned for the Tasty Tuesday Man. Cue the music. Turn off the oven. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Make these at your Super Bowl party. I can't tell you how they taste yet, but at the very least, you will look like a really, really cute Pinterest-worthy host. Holy shit. If you're rooting for a team that's losing and you don't want to see the score anymore, look at these. Yeah. Okay, we have today on this fantastic Tasty Tuesday. Are you gonna introduce me? Uh, everybody, the Tasty Tuesday man. Hi, I'm the Tasty Tuesday guy. Today we have um, a lacrosse sponsorship. Just kidding. That would've been tight. Yeah, it would be tight. Damn. Sponsor us, please. If we're looking for it, we desperately need it. Ad since Apocalypse is killing us. So we have beer, chili, cornbread, cupcakes. Beer, chili, cornbread, cupcakes. Yeah, beer, chili, cornbread, cupcakes. Great branding. Thank you. You don't like it? No, what did you call it? Are you being sarcastic? Your voice just sounds sarcastic all the no, time? No, I'm, I'm gonna taste it and I'll tell you what I call it. All right. Oh, snap. Yeah? Yeah, that's really dang good. Hell yeah! Is it tasty? Very. It's tasty! <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to yell. I would call them chili cornbread cakes. No, beer chili cornbread cake? Cornbread cake? Is it beer chili? Yeah, it's beer chili. What kind of beer is it? Modelo Negra. Modelo. Modelo Say Negra. Like Modelo. I don't think you're more cultured than I am. I... I think we're about the same. Yeah, probably. <laughs> mm -hmm. Can I taste it or what? Yeah, this, one, this, is, this one's are for me. Oh, all of those are for you? I guess you can have one here. Thank you, that's very nice of you. Oh, damn. That's good. It's like soul food, dude. That's good. Dude, you have to make these. If you have to make these. If it's cold outside, make these. Oh, uh, you could walk around with this. You could tailgate with these. You could go tailgating. It's portable. This is so good. You should make these. And you have a lot of chili left over, so like people that don't want to be cute, they could just have chili. But like, this is so cute and so good. Oh, definitely make these. Also, check out my sketch that I did last week on my channel. Just go check it out. Give it a like. Subscribe so you don't miss any of this. And I'll see you next time. Bye. I tried watching your sketch, but it didn't show up in my sub box. Yeah, that hurt.